Hello, this is Mary with All Things Automotive, bringing you here today a 2021 Honda Civic Type R Touring. This vehicle features a 2-liter 16V engine with no accidents or damages reported to Carfax. This is a Carfax certified one owner vehicle, which helps to keep that odometer reading low. As you can see, this vehicle is a very sleek boost boot pearl with ebony and crimson accents as you'll be able to see whenever we go inside. Also down there, notice that there is a fog light which will help you in inclement weather. We'll continue around here from the front to the side of the vehicle and take note of that tire there. All Thing Automotive guarantees at least double the state minimum or better on all of our tire treads. I'll get the results of those to you in just a second though from the multi-point inspection that this vehicle has underwent. All Thing Automotive gives all of our vehicles a new state inspection, a new oil change, a new cabin air filter, and a new engine air filter, so you don't need to worry about replacing any of those anytime soon. Here on the outside of the mirror caps are your turn signal indicators. This will help other drivers see it just a bit easier than only on the rear. These mirrors are also heated, which will help to prevent fogging as well as defrosting in the winter. Now here on the door, if you can see that black button on the door handle, is your passive keyless entry. All you need to do is put a finger over that and you will be able to enter your vehicle without needing to take your keys out of your pockets. Speaking of keys, with the purchase of this vehicle, you do get two keys, so that'll give you some added flexibility with that. As we enter the vehicle now, you'll be able to see that those ebony and crimson highlights are really the centerpiece of the inside of this vehicle on those simulated suede seats. We'll now take a look inside the glove box here and get at the results of that multi-point inspection. As you can see here, um, your tire treads are 5 30 seconds all the way around. And as for your brake pads, they are 12 30 seconds in the front and 10 30 seconds in the rear. We'll now continue our way around the vehicle, giving you a tour now of the rear occupant seating. All right, and as you can see, that sleek design is continued here even in the rear passenger seats. I'll also point out that in the rear passenger seats, you do have cup holders for their comfort. We'll continue our way to the rear of the vehicle. And as you can see, that sleek spoiler up top, as well as down here, you do have that rear view backup camera, so that'll help you whenever you are backing up to avoid any collisions. As you can see here, you've got a good amount of space to store any items you would like. You also have this retractable screen that you can put over your items to prevent the sun from hitting them or from curious passerbys to seeing them. Those seats up there do fold back, so I will show you what they look like in just a second when they are folded back. All right, here we are back with those seats folded down in that visor back. And as you can see that there is a lot more space to haul some rather large items inside, as well as having a hidden compartment underneath the floorboard to store any tools or any smaller items you want. You also have an additional removable sun visor and privacy blind, so that'll give you a bit more of the horizontal protection as well. We'll make our way to the front of the vehicle now. And I do want to mention that this vehicle does have the standard power mirror and door settings, as well as having six-way seating, forward backwards, tilting forward and back, and up and down. Now to the left of the steering wheel are several toggles for the built-in features of vehicle stability assist which will help to prevent skidding and sliding. Road departure mitigation will choose a warning system that will let you know if you're leaving your lane. And collision mitigation braking system which will automatically start to brake if it detects a collision happening. All of these can be turned on and off as you like as that is what those buttons are for. We'll turn on the vehicle now and I'll just show you some of the readings there as you can see on the odometer we are just under 8,000 miles on this vehicle and I'll also show you here the features on the steering wheel. Here on the left side of the steering wheel those buttons are to navigate the dashboard menu and right underneath that are your Bluetooth and call buttons as this vehicle does have smartphone integration. On the right side is the adaptive cruise control settings. Adaptive cruise control is very handy whenever you are cruising along the highway. You can set a speed and the vehicle will remain at that speed. Unless you begin to follow a vehicle and it detects that, it will remain a certain car length away from the vehicle in front of you. It will continue to follow. We'll now continue on to the center console of the vehicle. As you can see, this vehicle does have that smartphone integration along with all of those apps. This vehicle also has built-in navigational systems to help you get around. And now I'll just throw it into reverse here to show you that backup camera in action. 
We'll now take a look at that lower center console. This vehicle does come with this USB charging port, which extends out to about a foot to give you some flexibility around that center gear shift. You also have your typical climate and volume control settings. As we continue to look down a little bit farther, you'll be able to see this vehicle does come with a parking brake to keep you still even on hills or drive mode shift if you want increased handling or a smoother ride. You do have two cup holders here, as well as a small console compartment in order to store your valuable items in. And the cup holders and small tray do move side to side, so you're able to adjust that a little bit. Down here, you also have an additional charging port. And that generally concludes the inside of the vehicle. Now for this last section of the video, we know a lot of our customers come from very far away, and we want to make the purchasing process as transparent and straightforward as we possibly can. This vehicle is pre-owned and we want you to know exactly what you're getting with it, imperfections and all. So as for this last section of the video, we'll be going over if this vehicle has any blemishes or stains. We'll start here on the front of the vehicle and just look closely because typically on the front of the vehicles you get several stone chips. However, for the most part, there is a small one there. For the most part, the paint is very much intact on the front. Um, a small scratch there on the chrome of the headlight. Looking down, it is very much intact. We'll continue our way to the side of the vehicle. Again, looking down there for any stone chippings. Looking up, there's a small scratch there, maybe from whenever they entered the vehicle. We'll continue our way to the back. I don't see any there. Um, now here along the bumper is where there are typically also some scratches. Um, you can see there are some small stains here. Um, it's just whenever people put things or in or take things out of the vehicle, there typically isn't a great amount of care. But the bumper is very much intact as well, aside from um, a few very minor scratches. We'll continue down here. I don't see anything along the windows here. Um, some small stains at the bottom. And that generally concludes this video vehicle tour. There are a lot of fantastic features within this vehicle. If you are looking for a sleek and sporty four door manual hatchback, this is a good option for you. If you're interested in this vehicle, come and check it out at All Things Automotive, located at 21518 Great Cove Road, McConnellsburg, PA. Or you can give us a call at 717-485-4224. You can also check out this hatchback and other listings at www.allthingsautomotive.com. I hope you have a great day and thank you for watching this video.